You attend, whether you believe it or not, Northwest Arkansas is growing rapidly. A recent study from the U.S. Census Bureau says the area grows by 36 people a day. The city of Fayetteville wants the cultural scene to grow just as fast. 5 News reporter Lauren Spencer shares how they're creating a long-range plan for it. Fayetteville has had this long history of being a place for artists and musicians and for cultural expression. And in order for that to continue as we grow, we have to think strategically about that. You might be familiar with the term keep Fayetteville funky to keep that vibrant culture around. The city of Fayetteville is asking for your input on a 10 year roadmap. It's the first time we've ever sort of done this kind of strategic work. It's an opportunity to tell the city what art means to you and what Fayetteville needs more of. Everything from murals in public space to cultural institutions. And as the region grows every day, they need to be prepared. So if you don't plan to be a culturally vibrant place, you aren't going to continue to organically be that culturally vibrant place. Garrett Gonzalez is a Northwest Arkansas native who says the culture is one thing that makes the town unique. I love art. I love murals and stuff. His art? skating. If someone can make a abstract, an abstract sculpture that I could skate, I would love that. Could I match the art's energy or could I match a sculpture's energy with this trick, with the skateboarding, how I'm moving. Preserving all the unique things the city has to offer while making sure artists can still call it home. How do we better build structures to help artists in the future so that we can stay um, for lack of a better term, uh, the funky that Fayetteville has always been. In Fayetteville, covering news where you live, Lauren Spencer, 5 News. That skate park as an art design is pretty cool. Well, the city says you can fill out the survey for what you want to see online, as well as see them in city events like the Farmer's Market to share your input. And after gathering all these ideas, the city is hoping to form a solid 10-year plan to debut in the fall.